Hey guys, it's and, and today we are going to read another book. But I, I'm sorry I posted so many books about reading, but I just want to um like um, teach you guys something, make you guys learn something new. And today we're learning about sea stars. I've already read this book a bunch of times. I'm sorry I posted this on Monday, but because. I keep forgetting to do it other way, so... Okay, so let's start. Sea stars are... Hold on. So, it says, Sea stars are in Canada, I'm pretty sure. With spinny skin. They are often called starfish, but they are not... Are, but they are not fish. If you guys did not know that, um, then leave a comment down below. And guys, wait, hold on. Hold! Hold the phone. There's two things different about me. Comment down below what you see that's different about me. There are about 2,000 different types of sea stars. They are found on the ocean floor and in coral reefs. I've tried this before, but it did not record when I said, hey guys. Make sure to subscribe, please. Sea stars come in many colors. They are purple, red, pink, orange, or white. Some are blue. They range in size from about 0 0.4 inches, 1 centimeter to 3 feet, 1 meter from arm to arm. The smallest sea star is a paddle spinned sea star, and the largest sea star in the world is the sunflower star. Which is this sunflower, which is, this is the sunflower star. Five or more arms called rays. Wait, hold on. Did I, not, did I show you this page? No, I, I did not think I did. Five or more arms called rays are attached to a sea star's central disc. If a sea star loses a ray, a new one grows. Each ray has an eye on its tip. Sea stars use their eyes to stay close to the reef. Look at this. This is a beautiful. I love this book. Uh, yeah, this is a this is a weird page. I've read this book a lot of times. Sea stars have two feet on the underside of their rays. The two feet pump water to make the sea stars move. Did you know that sea stars sea stars can move? If you did, not learn something new. If you don't mind, then you learn something new. Suckers are at the end of each foot. These help sea stars attach to rocks and reefs. I've never seen a sea star in the world. Wait, hold on. Oh, the phone! I'm not used to, like, turning the pages for you guys. I'm not like, letting you guys see. But that's the back of the sea star that you just saw. Sea stars are carnivores. They feed on slow-moving animals. My sickness is actually away. Sorry if I told you that already. But on the Candy Land video... Guys, remember that one if you have not watched it. Go watch it. Or, they're or you're going to be confused. They use their strong sense of smell to find prey. Clams are a favorite food. Sorry, I w I'm wasting so much time on talking. But I just love talking. Just to do again. I actually have gel in my hair. Sea Star is you there. Can I show you this one? Comment down below if I showed you this page. Sea stars use their two feet and suckers to pull open clamshells, which is a favorite food. Then a sea star pushes its stomach through its mouth. The sea star squeezes, I mean, the stomach squeezes into the open, mat, I mean, shell. Finally, it digests the clam. Sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sea stars hide to escape predators. They may bury themselves in sand. Their spinny, colorful skin helps them blend in with coral reefs. If you heard that, then if you did not, go rewind and, he and see if you can hear that. That's my cat, Leo. If you have not watched the videos, the other videos that I showed you in, go watch them. Female sea stars can lay millions of the eggs at a time. Did I show you this page? No, I did not. Yeah. Let me, let me read 
restart this page. Sea star, I mean female sea stars can lay millions of eggs at a time. Tiny babies grow from the eggs. Sorry if you could hear that. That's my cat Leo. These larvae float to find food. They start to look like sea stars after about three weeks. There's no way that that that, that baby sea star can be like a jelly. I mean sea star because it looks like a jellyfish. Seriously, I'm not joking. Some, some sea stars make new life by splitting into two. When this happens, a new sea star forms. Just ignore that my cat making noise. Soon there are two sea stars instead of one. Okay, that was the end of my book. Now I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you didn't, make sure to get your pet sea star. If you do, but if you do not have one, then get a piece of paper draw a sea star on it then um then make then then press those two buttons the like button and the subscribe button comment down below if i missed any words if any pictures to show you guys but if and also what i have no what you noticed that's different about i'll show you guys again so you have a better chance does it look good and so yeah draw the sea star if you do not have a pet sea star and press that subscribe button i really mean just press the subscribe button and like button but yeah yeah what could go wrong <laughs> and i will see you in the next time bye bye guys Bye.